Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel Natalie Rea here and welcome to today's video for today's video Phoenix and I are finally gonna go in search of Dirndls and letter Holzen. So it is October fest season. Okay, actually it's like the end of it Sunday is the last day which is in two days I wanted to go the first two weekends, but it was just impossible Phoenix had to work and all of that So it just got in the way and also we haven't had a chance to go shopping for the dirndl or for the letter letter holes in I'm most likely saying both of those extremely wrong. We're gonna be going to Biden. Everything closes early, so we really, really have to rush over there. But before we continue, if you're not subscribed, make sure to subscribe down below right now. Also, make sure you click that little notification bell button. It's right next to the subscribe button so you can don't miss out from any of my upcoming new videos. And if you would like to follow me on Instagram at Natalie Raya, that's how you can find me. All right. Oh, wow, I'm actually starving. Shopping center, the first place that we're gonna check out is HM. Since I'm 100 percent sure that we do have really cheap journals there. Okay, so since tomorrow is the last day, all of these are on sale. Like this is probably the cheapest one that I have seen. This color right here. I don't really I don't know. I'm kind of thinking about this one. And then and this one right here oh my goodness talk about cute <gasps> it had to be 90. you guys i'm absolutely tripping i tried on a size 32 which is like an extra small and a size 34 which is a small and neither of them fit this size right here the 34 this would not close i'm like shook okay so i tried this one on so i'm thinking about either this one or this one this one's only 16 this one's 21. i like them both i don't know it's a hard one this was option one which is a pink one and then there's option two i honestly love 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 the blue one but <laughs> i also like the pink one why do I want that hat over there? I think it's cute. Also, gloves. I feel like I need gloves. So I am always in search of wax and it's so hard for me to find it. Um, I literally have no luck anywhere. Okay, so I went with the blue one plus the bag that you have to pay for. I'm honestly still shook about the fact that a size 32 and 34 did not fit. Like, that can't be right. Like, there's something fishy about that. Also, since we're running out of time, literally we have like one hour until all of these stores closed. We also have to go to Erika today today it has to be today because i have been out of coffee for the past two days and i've been buying iced coffee and it's like five euro and i don't want to keep doing that every single day so we need to go get coffee so we're actually gonna go straight to grab hopefully stop in little i believe it's little because i've heard that they have some stuff over there because phoenix hasn't found any ladder hosen so we're still looking for his which sucks because there's a chance that he's not gonna find any what kind of coffee is that it's a mo mochaccino oh. Okay, people like talk about how they find like 49 cents coffees at Etika. So I'm gonna look for them <laughs> right now. Ooh! Is it good? It actually is good. It's kind of weird. I would have thought it would have come with those it? little. Yeah, I did. I've had like the, like little Starbucks ones like this that you could find at the stores, and it comes with a little tiny straw, but this one didn't have any. It's cold. It's good. Cafe Latte Macchiato. I think I need a new tripod. So everyone always touches my tripod. Everywhere I take my camera and I set it down. When I get back, the legs are like all over the place, like these little guys. So now it's like super, super loose because everyone detaches them. Oh, the copy, the copy. And I mean, they're not the cheapest. I think I paid like $35 for this one. So I really don't want to get another one. So weather wise, it is raining. It started getting cold here about two, three days ago. And it looks like it's going to stay like this for the rest of the year. I asked my in-law which one did she like the most she said pink i feel like the pink one looked extremely cheap 
like just really cheap made and then the blue one looks a little bit more traditional so back to the weather what I was saying is that it's gonna be kind of hard because I'm gonna be in a dress like, I cannot picture any type of sweater that's gonna go <laughs> good with this dirndl so I'm gonna be freezing it's gonna be raining I don't know really quick we're gonna try this store right here it looks like they have clothes I always thought of this store as a grocery store so let's see Look at how cheap these are. Ugh, I want one. Can't keep them alive though. Okay, so it looks like it's just this little section. I feel like people were maybe saying online, like little online. I don't even know what they call this store. But um, I don't see nothing in store. So maybe it was online only. Okay, let's go. Let's go try the next store. Okay, no luck in the store. Little. Really quick, we're going to Keek. Okay. Look, Phoenix. <laughs> so cute. <gasps> I love these. I would wear these. Like this. And they're only $13. These are little boy sizes. The con. This totally fits me. Oh my goodness. I would be so warm in there. There was nothing at Keek. The only place that's left is literally NKD. Everything is closed. It's only 6 I've never been to the thrift shop here in Grab. So MKD was also closed, tell me why, on a Friday at 6 p.m. This is a thrift shop. Oh, that's kind of cool. Now I know where it's at, but it's closed. Okay, let's just go to Erika. Last stop of the day, Erika. I need to get some stuff. I'm actually really, really excited to be using this. So shout out to Susan Nelson. She works at Service Credit Union. Okay, we need um, these for some Vietnamese spring rolls. Just one. Okay, so now I'm putting it back. And I get my little coin back, which is kind of cool because it's no longer an actual coin. Alright guys, so I am now home. This is a dress that I ended up getting. I know I already showed you guys, but here it goes again. I also never really wear blue, so this is new. I like how it was on sale. They were originally $50, and I got it for $15.99. Since basically this is the last weekend, you know, they have to put everything on sale. So what I have to do right now is actually try and find how to complete this outfit, like shoes, socks, top since this didn't come with the top but in my last video i showed you guys that i got this like puffy shoulder top just in case i needed to wear a dirndl and it didn't come with the top so i'm gonna try it on with that one and see if that's gonna work out and then i'll figure out the shoes right now so this is the top right here it, you know it kind of looks like it will go with it okay so here is the dirndl with the shirt that i got it doesn't really like stay up here it keeps coming down um i don't know how i feel about it this is how it looks i still don't know what shoes i would wear with this so let's go figure that out so i can either do like mm, tan boots with like white socks or i could just do white sneakers okay are you guys ready to see this so these are the only two options that i would actually like consider wearing and don't mind the dog tags so obviously you guys know sneaker fan this is more me this would be the other option i do think that the boots are a little bit too high i would like them to be like down to the ankles but this is the only type of tan boots that i have so what do you guys think sneakers or boots so we ended up getting a pizza since we've been out all day and here's how it turned out phoenix picked it out i told him to get whatever and i'm regretting it now but it actually looks really good i don't know if i really like it oh my god me eating it all i just found out it has pockets it has one pocket and that's all i really need this right here oh how amazing Ooh. Okay, so I think I've decided that I'm definitely going to go for the sneakers. Now, the top. Here is this one. This one has a lot of detail going on. It's really cute. However, the sleeves are not long enough and they keep going down. I like how some tops do this and like they come out here and it's more of a square top. But then if I do that, it's like really tight over here and then my fat just pops out. I'm going to try this one really quick and see which one looks better. Here is the other top. 
So this one is a lot more plain. I really like this one because it's a little bit more ruffled. This one is a little bit more puffy. I like that and I like that the sleeves are actually a little bit longer. They're pretty long and also it's going to be very, very cold. So I feel like that's going to make a difference. Okay, I think I have everything figured out. Uh, that is not 100% true. I am 100% sure that in the morning I am going to be running around like crazy. Hold on. I don't... What time are we even leaving? We actually leave at... 7 in the morning that's the time the bus leaves uh, meaning that we have to be there at least by 6 40 maybe 6 40 so that means that i have to wake up at six o'clock i'm gonna have about 35 minutes to get ready i'm sure i could do that i am actually gonna be curly oh my gosh i think i should be waking up earlier just because today is my second day hair so i definitely have to wash it because tomorrow is just gonna be like super greasy and we don't want that we actually want to go prepared so i'm gonna take a shower right now and i'm gonna wash my hair and i'm gonna let it air dry by itself it is really late already it's like 9 30 but i'm 100 sure that we're not gonna be going to bed until like most likely midnight so by then it's gonna be dry and then when i wake up tomorrow i can just go ahead and do some little curls some waves here and there i think i should be good to go i have everything that i'm gonna be wearing down on the floor like piled up pretty sure it's gonna be raining <gasps> Should I take an umbrella? I think I should. So Munich is two hours and seven minutes away from Grafenbeer, which is where we're going to be getting the bus. So if it's two hours away driving, it's probably going to be about two and a half to three hours in the bus, most likely. We're not going to be getting there until 10 in the morning. Also says that it's going to be raining and it's not just like 10%, it's freaking 70 percent definitely going to be taking that umbrella but anyways i am gonna end today's video right here i don't worry i am taking you guys along with me to oktoberfest i am so excited my first time ever going i do want to give out a shout out and today's shout out goes out to d amenta shout out to you and if any one of you guys will also like a shout out all you have to do is make sure to be subscribed and comment anything your big old heart desires i love you guys all i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up subscribe if you're not subscribed to join the raya family and i'll see you guys tomorrow bye guys